my name's Cameron. And that's my man, Steven. We work pretty well together as a team. He's a very sensitive man. And he likes to go deep. We do everything together, and everything is magic. Today I plan on giving him a promise ring that'll make us exclusive. Finally, it'll just be me and him. Wish me luck! Speaking of which, it was gorgeous out there. Oh there. yeah, it was beautiful out yeah. there. I gotta say, impressed with your layup at this point. Oh, thanks. Yeah. Thank you. Was that the, uh, something you've been working on, or...? Yeah, I've been working on that, my left hand. Oh, yeah. There. You were yeah. pretty good on the grabs there, too. Do you want some water? Ah, uh, no, I think I'm just gonna grab a quick shower to cool down. Shower or bath? I think a shower, just a shower. Hey Steven, the water's ready. Uh, I'm actually just online looking at some hot guys. That's pretty gay. Why don't you come hop in with me? Um, you know, maybe a little bit. Yeah, just, yeah, just a bit. Steven, do you know where the scissors are? God, look like Vietnam down there. Steven! Steven, I need to trim my pubis. Steven. What? I'm listening to my rock beats. Scissors. Pubis. Oh, yeah. I think they're uh, they're in the kitchen. I actually used them to cut open the milk. The new bag of milk. Hey, Steven. What are you watching? Just threw on my favorite Tyra. Tyra Banks? Yeah, yeah. It's the uh, one with the child beauty pageants. Oh, that's cruel. So, are you still coming over tonight? Yeah, what time were you thinking? I was thinking around 7, and I got a surprise for you. Yeah? Pizza and cake. Nice. Steven, I thought you'd be a little bit more excited about pizza and cake. I mean, it's your Oh, favorite. sorry. No, I'm sorry. I am. It's just, um, I'm a little tired. We had a pretty big morning. All right, well, I'll stay out of your hair for a few hours. You rest up, all right? All right. <laughs> I'll see you later. See you at 7, Steven. See ya. I called it for a reason, actually. Like, I've been... Lately, things haven't been going so well with uh, me and Cameron, like... Really? Alright, I'm gonna give you an example. Today, he was over, and you know, we went out and we were playing catch and that sort of thing. Yeah. He came inside and, uh, he decided he wanted to shower and I didn't want to go in with him. It's a little odd. And said he, so you know, he calls out to me, he's like, you want to come in? And uh, happened, you know, I was actually online looking at ladies. What? No way. You weren't looking at ladies. I was. I was. Are you saying you're straight now? I, I'm like, basically, I don't know. I'm not attracted. It seems like I'm not attracted to guys anymore. But Steven, you're so, so gay. I'm, well, kind of, I'm pretty gay, but I don't know, like... Not anymore. I don't know what's going on. You know, I'm, I'm, I'm worried he, he's like he's having me over tonight for pizza and cake, which is like our special thing, and he's got a surprise for me, but uh, I don't know. Are you going to break up? I don't know. That's why I'm calling. Like, what should I do? Well, you're just going to have to tell him the truth. Yeah. Tell him how you feel, and he's just going to have to face it. Um, man, this flips my world around. Like, I've changed in front of you. Oh. Do you have a bag by any chance I could use? Uh, I might have something. Yeah. Hold on. Yeah. So we 
rig out here. Some big buck hunter. Batman. You either die a hero, or you live long enough to see yourself become the villain. Hey, Steven. I haven't sure. seen you in such a long time. How are you? I'm doing all right. How are you doing? I'm doing well. You seem to be doing well at the game. So I haven't seen you out lately. No, I haven't actually been going out too much. I actually uh, started seeing someone. Oh, who? Uh, his name is Cameron. You know Cameron? Which one are you talking about? He's kind of short, long hair. Oh, that Cameron. Yeah, yeah. You know him? Okay. Yeah. Kind of. Yeah, he's Don't want to say how, yeah. but kind of. I got a quick question for you. Okay. Kind of off topic. Have you ever been attracted to any ladies before? Never. Neither have I, man. Yeah, for sure. I was just, yeah. It was nice to see you. I do got to get running, actually, at the camp's okay. making me dinner. So, well, yeah. you have a good day, then. Nice to see you. Have a good one. Thank you. You were the first one I had pizza nuggets with. You remember that day? The day we met. The day we met. The day yeah. we met. Where were we at? Wally World. Mm-hmm. Mm-hmm. Oh, jeez. I remember you went down the bullet, and your bathing suit went entirely up your ass. <laughs> and I thought you had just the cutest butt. And oh, I... <laughs> thank you. I, you know, times have changed a little bit since then, but, uh, yeah. I missed the bullet. I missed the bullet, too. What a lovely night, though. It is, yeah, no, it's been a good day. I had a nice nap. Uh, I got to go to the arcade, you know. it's The sports were great. You know, Stephen, uh, the pizza and the cake wasn't the only surprise I had for you tonight. What do you mean? Well, there's something else that I kind of wanted to give you. What is this? Don't be naive, Stephen. I'm not being naive. Here, take it. Like, this is... Try it on. This is a nice ring, Cameron, but I'm not trying this on. Steven, it would look great on you. Try it on. I'm not trying this on. I'm sorry. We've been going out for six months now, Steven. Six months is a long time, but a promise ring? So soon? Steven, take the ring. I'm not taking the ring, Cameron. You know what? I gotta go for a walk. Steven! 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 Shit. Steven! What? Why'd you walk out on me? I told you, I needed a few minutes. It's, I, it's nothing you've done. It's nothing you've done at all. It's just something that I, I've changed in the past few months. I know it's not a thing that makes sense right now to you. It probably won't make sense to you. I'm just not attracted to guys anymore. But that's not, that's beside the point here. It's the fact that it, when I grew up, there was a lot of pressure to be gay. I know that doesn't make any sense. Had the big role in Annie. Vin Diesel was gay. You had Elton John was gay. Like, look at we're s surrounded by like a fake plastic gay looking tree as we stand right here. Are you saying the whole world's gone gay? I'm saying the whole world's gone gay and I got pressured into it and it's actually not who I am. It's who I thought I was. Steven, you make it seem like being gay is a trend or it's a, fa a passing fad or something, that it's a fad to be a fag. Well, it's not a fad to be a fag, Steven. It's something you're born with. Something that you have to learn to live with. You have to learn to understand yourself. And you just don't understand that. You drag me along, Steven. You drag me along. I'm sorry it had to end this way, Steven. You're an asshole. You know what? Whether or not Steven is straight or gay doesn't matter. I loved him. It was what it was. And now he's embarking on a journey more confusing than I ever will. The story of Steven and I was a short one. Just like his penis. Steven, your creamy white skin and your orchid smile. You. I want to love you. Uh -huh. You know, boy. 
save the last kiss for me. <laughs> Stephen.